Hello, welcome back. So today what we're doing is another test to test, um, say to test for whether two series or two, two data series um, has have equal variances or basically standard deviation. So we, the test that we'll be using is this called Plinger Lean's test. Okay. This is a test we'll be using as for homogeneity of variances. Okay, so this is one of the many tests for to test whether it's two sets of data having the same. Um, variance or can the variance be assumed equal? This is very useful for t test when it comes to the next part. Okay, so how do we do that? Let's say the null hypothesis that we have is that um, the variance, say variance of hip equals to variance of waist. Okay, so the two variances are equal. Oops. By this way. Okay, the alternate hypothesis is then the variance of hip is not equal to the variance of waist. Okay, so how do we do that? Okay, so we will do a this is for Flinger Killen's test. And then X, what we need to do is to write down waist and theta hip, waist against hip. And the data that we want to use is your diabetes. Okay. So now, EIG runs a chi square test. Essentially, the p value is 0 0.1144, meaning to say that the chances. Of, of in practical sense, um, 11.4% 4, 11 that the variances of hip and waist can be assumed equal. Okay, so with that, um, we cannot reject the null hypothesis, we assume that the variances can be equal. Okay, another way to do it is if you do not want to have the diabetes here, then we use our regular way diabetes, waist, and diabetes hip it will give you the same result okay. you can use this to test whether is the variance of waist equals to the very can be equal to the variance of h um, it's still um cannot reject now hypothesis is still the variances can be assumed equal so that is one test okay that's all that we have for, for today see you next round